What is up, you all? Now, this is the one and only Queen of Soul tribute at the 2019 Grammys. Let's get right into it. Okay. Fantasia. Okay. She looks beautiful here. Yeah. Sounds good too, of course. Save it. Save it. They sound excellent. But it was still savage. Sustain! Sustain! Man, Tasia looks like she always catching a spear. It don't matter what she's saying about. She always. <laughs> like that one person at church who always, every Sunday, just be on the floor. Um. I loved it. I liked it. I loved it. I liked it. Um, I, I thought it was. I thought, um, especially Yolanda Adams, she took that joint home. She was on pitch, on key the whole time, and she was, she was just tasteful. Her powerful, naturally. I mean, she, her range, higher chest is naturally just incredibly powerful and 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 easier for her to to, to access than the other two. Um, and it, it, it just, it's fuller up there in the, in the higher chest belt and, and she just did it and her transition to that head voice real quick, that was smooth and her just sustaining in the high chest. I, I just loved it. I loved it. She didn't mess up. There were no mistakes from her and I'm just, I, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. She always, she always just destroys tributes to people. Like really, she is always just blowing people away on tributes. Now, Vantasia. I love me some Vantasia too. Um, I mean, just her runs and her riffs. I'd say she's the most agile with the runs and things, and she was bodying it from the start with those little runs here and there. I mean, just sick, just 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 sick. And um, for her, she was very she held back. You know, she was she's the type that you know she just go mad and throw kick off her shoe and just go ham, Patty Labelle style. But she was very. She held it in. It, she was respectful. Nice, respectful tribute. That note she sustained 
while it did seem a little pitchy to my ears, or maybe it's just her natural tone when she goes higher, it's a little bit more. Honestly, it's not as full and powerful as Elinda's. It, it's it's really, really sharp and sort of just just sort of a little twangy. But um, I, I prefer her in the mids and the lows is what I'm saying. But I don't know. To me, let me let me know if, if, if it was just sharp or is it just her, her maybe or a little her lighter twangy highs that kind of sort of confused me because it just didn't sound right about it. But nonetheless, it was impressive nonetheless that she could sustain like that without knowing how much she like growls and, and the rasp and, and sort of screams and you know that that church stuff it's impressive that she can still do that just just more clear um and sustain it for that long nonetheless now um i believe it was audrey audrey day now um she sounded incredible she sounded incredible I don't know if the outfit was a nod to Aretha when she first came out, maybe that time period. I don't know what, what, she, what she was what she was going for with it, but, but nonetheless, she sounds good, and that's what's important, right? That's what's important. Um, I loved her. Says, I'll rise up. Everybody knows that it was on the radio constantly. Um, I love her. I love her voice, and um, she she really sang. She sounded really good, really good, and um, she did a few runs um, which were really nice, and her just her tone. And her vibrato is just, she's got her own thing, her own style. It looks sort of like an old school sound and vibrato and twang that she has that um, not many people have today. Um, she's just sort of a, she's like a throwback to me. Vocally, she just, for some reason, I, she's just a throwback to me. Um, but um, I, I loved it. I loved it. I, but especially, especially Yolanda Adams. She never fails me. She never fails, even though she wasn't, the, she's not the most agile of these people. I really, her runs were the most tasteful. Her wrist, the things, little ones she did here and there were the most tasteful to me. And just everything she did, the high note she chose, the transition, it was all just so tasteful and brilliant. And just, she's just, I mean, she's, she's, she's aged like fine wine, like vocally. She's beautiful too. They all beautiful. Thanks for liking and subscribing. Please continue to more of your favorite space.